Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Nikki Marie back with another video. So I'm back with another USPS video. This video is going to be me telling you guys 10 things I hated while I was a city carrier. So let's get into it. Okay, so these things aren't in any particular order. The first one that I have is pivots. So a pivot is basically when you do your route and you do a part of another route, but you're doing it all in your eight hours. So you're not getting that overtime for that little bump that you're doing. You're just doing all this work in your eight hours, okay? Hated pivots. Like, just give me my overtime, that's all. That's all I'm wanting. Okay, so the next thing I hated is when it was time to go to the bathroom, you have to literally most likely go off of your route to go find a bathroom. And you might have to do that multiple times a day. I hated leaving my route and having to go find a bathroom and wasting more time because I have a lot of work to do and I need to get to it. But no, I have to leave my route. So yeah, I hated that. Okay, so the next thing I hated is mandatory overtime. So as a CCA, you guys know, and if you don't, I'm gonna tell you. There's a lot of times where you just have to do overtime. You might go into work and there's like four or five routes down. You're gonna have to do a bump, okay? And you really have no choice, literally no choice. You gotta do your route and then you gotta do this other stuff over here, whether you like it or not. So the next thing I hated is something I would probably put at the top of my hate list, but that is PDI. So when you, do something you're not supposed to do, you get a PDI. You get written up for some stuff that you did. You might have made a mistake on your route. Maybe you forgot to scan something. They're gonna write you up for that. When I was a city carrier, I hated write-ups because it's just like, you're trying to stress me out, why? I make mistakes. I'm not a robot. Cut me some slack. Why do you have to write me up every day? And literally the station that I was at was so bad. Like a lot of people would get written up almost every day. It was crazy. Okay, the next thing I hated while being a city carrier was having to walk six to 12 miles a day. So the station that I was at, it was pretty much almost all walking routes. And then we had like a couple of mounted routes, but of course the senior people had those routes. So we barely got to fill in on those routes, but basically all the routes in our station were at least six miles of walking a day. So by the end of the day, my feet were barking, sores and all types of stuff from walking so much. Okay, the next thing I hated while being a city carrier is weird customers. So this is just my perspective of what I went through when I was a city carrier. I feel like I ran into a lot more weirdos, men who would come to the door in their robes and boxers and all of that. But I'm just like, just let me deliver the mail in peace. Don't open the door and try to show me your junk. No one wants to see that. Okay, so the next thing I hated while being a city carrier is the weather. Being out in the weather, snow, sleet, rain, hot. I remember this time, it was so hot. I literally had to pull over my truck, get out, sit under the tree, and continue drinking my Gatorade and my water. It was that bad. Like, I almost had a heat stroke out there because it was burning up. So I hate being out in the weather, especially the rain. At the end of the day, you're soaking wet. Even with the freaking rain suit thing on, you still soaking wet. Don't make no sense. The next thing that I hated is peak season. So honestly, this applies to any job in the post office. Peak season is, it's bad. Like you will hate the holidays if you work at the post office during peak season. People go crazy. Even during a pandemic last year, people were going nuts. So yeah, I'm not looking forward to that coming up here soon. <laughs> All right, so the next thing I hated is the dreaded third bundle. Y'all know the freaking red plum, the Washington Post, like, and then you're carrying that heavy bag full of all them papers, hated it. Tuesdays and Thursdays are the days that we had to carry those at my station and I just dreaded working on those days because I'm like, oh gosh, we're gonna be here all day trying to deliver these. Okay, and the last and final thing that I hated while city carrying is the toxic work environment. When I tell you, the post office promotes within. So that means that a lot of these people have zero professionalism, especially the ones 
in their higher up positions. The supervisors, the managers, the postmasters, all of them. Professionalism on zero. Because when I tell you, it will be cursing matches, all types of stuff going on. Matter of fact, I have a whole other story I could tell y'all because when I was city carrying, I came with the same energy that they came to me with, okay? So that'll be a, a story for another day, but thank you guys so much for watching. That was a little quick little 10 things that I hated about city carrying. Currently, I am an RCA, so you know, my experience is a lot different now and it's a lot better. I will say that so yeah make sure you guys follow me on instagram give me any video ideas down below in the comments section and thank you guys so much for watching this video i will see you guys in the next one peace